I mean, just a lifeless, frankly, hopeless organization at this point in time. Just unbelievable. We're losing against teams like the Raiders. Um, we're pretty much the new Raiders. I'm sick of losing, man. I'm sick and tired of losing all the time. Marone's all in on Bortles. GM Dave Caldwell's all in on Bortles. And Tom Coughlin apparently is also all in on Bortles. Chad Henney, Blake Bortles. Somebody got to start for this team in week one. Who's it going to be? I don't know. If I'm a Jaguars fan right now, I'm looking, <laughs> yeah. I'm looking for something. And I, I don't know. It's yeah. a I, I think he's going to get a good number of touches, but I agree with you, Field. I do think there's a concern here about how much he can do as a runner. Yeah, this feels very asteroidy to me. Asteroidy. It feels very asteroidy. <laughs> Leonard Fournette, I hope you're Bo Jackson, my friend. You know, for the first time since September 11th, 2011, a span of 2,191 days, the Jacksonville Jaguars are over 500. They put back to back first downs together. Hand off to West. And he lost the football. Scooped up by Tilden Smith. Smith's got great speed down the sideline. Smith, and he's tackled inside the five. I mean, I don't want to get crazy about where the Jags are headed this year, but they are. The formula is, you know, as old as time, but they are. Uh, I mean, really, piece for piece. Maybe the third and I don't want to two, the best. 17 consecutive, 18 consecutive Whoa. runs. And this one may all the way. Fournette to the house. He's chased by Davis and Leonard Fournette racing 90 yards. And Shad Khan, their owner, coming up with one of the biggest wins since he has owned the team, obviously. Have you seen enough to say that they are turning the corner? Now, have they proved enough to you that they have turned the corner? They've turned the corner for no longer being the punchline. Win, loss, win, loss, win, loss, and then they got to win. So, well, that's it. The Jacksonville Jaguars have come in and dominated the Indianapolis Colts 27 to nothing. We talked during the week. Do you buy the Jaguars? I said, I don't buy you until you win two in a row. I mean, they're a 500 team. They won, lost, one loss. This is the one they have to win to make it two in a row. And the fact is, guys, with Deshaun Watson going down, the division now should be the Jaguars yeah. or the Titans. Somebody take this thing over. Win two in a row. Come on. Mickens at the 45. Mickens still going. Now he's got some room. Mickens trying to get to the outside. He does at the 10. Five. Touchdown. J. Don Mickens. 63 yards. I think Jacksonville would give the, the Patriots the biggest matchup Can problem. Can you say that one more time? <laughs> Just for the record books? For and the record the books. Lambeau's kick, partially deflected, and it still goes through! Lambeau against his former team, and the Jaguars beat the Chargers 20-17. to 17. Talk to me, man. Are the Jaguars for real? I don't need to question that. I don't even know why you keep questioning that. <laughs> we keep pushing each other like this. We keep loving each other like this. Yes, sir. We keep going out and battling like this. Yes, sir. I promise you, bro. I promise you, bro. It's the top and we ain't stopping. Yes, sir. And we ain't stopping. Yes, sir. Family on me, Joseph. Quarter, give a lot of credit. That's one hell of a team that we just beat. Break it down. Oh, okay.